The past. My name is Lord Gibson. The present. Father, forgive me for I have sinned. And the future. Sister Judith, who are my parents? What is it again? Have an appointment with the Gibsons. Honey, please. All his enemies are going to turn against us and they're going to be starting with you. You guys are just too stupid to know that she was sleeping with daddy. So, what family name was given to the child? Child trafficker. You smuggler. I will... You're your father. And this is just the beginning. Sadia is coming home. I am going to kill my husband. Sadia. And there's a reason why we play that. News is that Media General has received praise from government over its new telenovela series, which you just saw a promo of its uh, dear. And um, Tourism Minister Katmiya Fiku said his step taken by Media General is exemplary and must be emulated by other local media channels. Our reporter, Kwabne Dujenfi, is at the Ministry of Tourism Meets the Press series, and he joins me via phone. Hello, Kwabne. Hello, Wendy. Now, tell us a lot more about um, local content in, in relation to the recommendation given by the Minister of Tourism for TV3, that's Media General, showing um, Sadia, and then a lot more about what happened at the Media Press series. Okay, um, so the issue of um, foreign content taking over our local media came up during the press encounter with um, the Ministry of Tourism, and that was the point where the minister cited um, Sadia and Media General production as um, an example of the kind of content that um, we are looking for or government is looking at in terms of um, promoting local content. And she even went further to talk about the plot, um, the picture quality, the direction, the costume, and every single thing about um, Sadia. I mean, for her, she thinks that it, it's a good thing, and even other production houses and other media houses should emulate it. And um, that was the point where she also spoke about um, the reasons for which so far um, uh, her ministry has not been able to implement the um, film, the, the film Act, which was passed um, by Parliament um, in 2016, because that film act is supposed to um, um, work on production, it's supposed to work on regulation, marketing, and distribution of our local content for our movie producers and um, whoever is involved in um, these uh, production of series and all. So, um, mainly for us, this is a, 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 high, a high point for media in general because many people know and I've already also had the opportunity to talk to people who have not watched the series yet, and um, they want to watch it. Others who have watched it too, I also say, say the same thing about um, Sadia. They think it's a good content, and people should be encouraged to watch it as well, Wendy. Now, but aside that, are there any other matters that have come up at the Media Press series? Yes, um, the minister spoke about um, um, the 50 million US dollars that has been given to the ministry by the World Bank and um, how they are going to um, use that money uh, in terms of how they are going to use it for our beaches because we, she even acknowledged the fact that our beaches are very filthy and that alone puts tourists off. So um, they are going to make sure that within this year and in the subsequent years, they are going to make sure they beautify that. And also, she also gave reasons as to why so far they have not been able to build um, national theatres across the region as um, was promised in the um, MPP's manifesto some time back. Wendy. Thank you very much, Enid Komna um, Edujem Fee, for that update. We'll bring you somewhere in our subsequent bulletins. But make sure you don't miss the next episode of Sadia.